Um, I really appreciate you, and I'm honored to do this. Um, I know you haven't done any interviews. You've been very quiet um, about um, your case and what's going on and, you know, the details surrounding it. But before we get into what you can talk about concerning your case, I just want to ask um, uh, Three God, how are you doing? I'm well. I'm good. I'm, you know, taking it one day at a time. I'm not, you know, saying that this has been a pleasure or anything like that because it's been really tough. But I realize that um, I just got to keep myself up because I know I'm being tested. Try it, you know. It's been rough. I haven't been outside in about four months since I've been here. And um, it's just every day lockdown. Can't go out, you know, eat peanut butter and jelly every day. But I am meditating and coming to a lot of my knowledge and wisdom, you know, when um, just for us being away from the, um, your family, you know, and your loved ones. Okay. Okay. Now, are you locked down 24 hours a day or 23 hours a day? Yeah. Okay. Uh, 24 because of COVID. Okay. But, you know, we have a pod where you have, you get your phone calls, you feel me? But we're in this pod 24-7. I haven't been outside. Now, you're isolated from the population, correct? Right. So that means you're in a, a pod by yourself. Right. Not just a room, a pod. A pod with its film. Yeah. And, um... I got Silento right here with me. He's a, he's a um, celebrity, uh, the Nene guy. Let watch me, me with, watch me Nene. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah Silento. They put him in here with me. Because yeah. he's a celebrity. And so they call it special custody. And do they do that as, uh, do they, I guess, do they isolate the celebrities for your safety? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And so, obviously, yep. given the the um, you know your online presence, that that makes you um, a celebrity. And the charges and the, and the presence, yeah, and pretty much. Okay, well, I guess because for the first what three months you didn't have anyone to talk to um, besides um, your your followers, uh, meaning. Um, you know, the guys as well as your wife, your wives. Those were the only people you were communicating with, but you hadn't had any, uh, I guess, physical contact as far as uh, talking to people. Is that correct? Correct. Other than my lawyer. Okay. Um, You said you're eating peanut butter and jelly every day. Is that what they're serving? Every day, rice and beans, because I got the vegan tray. So rice and beans every day with veggies. I, that's, I get that once a day, and then I get peanut butter and jelly. Okay. And they give you breakfast. It's like an apple and whatever they'll serve you for breakfast. Okay. So they you, serve you too. Have you lost any weight? I mean, I mean, you've never been yeah, able to buy anything. Yeah, I was, I was pretty big. Um, um, I'm probably down like 20 pounds, but I, I'm, I'm six two. Two hundred pounds. So right now, you know, I mean, where I used to be like two twenty, two, you know, something. Okay. But you know, I lost weight yet. Okay. So, uh, wow. Okay. Um, I, I I don't wish. You know what I'm saying. I I just I I can't imagine. Um you know, what you're, what you're going through. And so again, like I said, I'm, uh, I'm appreciative that you even giving me this, you know, or, and, and allowing us to disseminate your side, um, unbiased, unchopped, unscrewed. Um, these are your words, um, not ours, and you're not being coerced or manipulated to, uh, uh, to do this. We've been uh, going back and forth about doing a phone interview, but you've been very, um, uh, focused on uh, beating your charges and you did not want to complicate uh, your case even more. And so you have exercised um, your right to remain silent until you felt that it was time to talk. Now, recently, uh, you were just indicted silently. They arrested you very publicly 
um, news crews was outside of your house. They had a SWAT team um, outside of the home uh, that you and your followers were um, living in. And um, from my understanding, the police have been showing up pretty much every day to bring pizza and, and things like that. And you, you recorded a lot of it um, until one day um, they came in and you, you were live. Of course, that was a smart thing to do to go live. Um, and, you know, they came to arrest you. And um, I don't know if they arrested the other members. Can you tell us about that night? Well, it was really the daytime. Um, the, uh, basically, you know, it was like uh, 